Well, Australia will boost its partnership with Germany in defence, trade and climate after successful talks between Prime Minister Anthony Albanese and his German counterpart, the Chancellor Olaf Scholz. Australia's initiation into Germany's so-called climate club will also see a collaboration on a climate control policy which accelerates international action on climate change and may well be a kicker for Australia to seal off that EU trade deal, we hope anyway. Germany will station a Royal Australian Air Force E-7A Wedgetail aircraft to help deliver aid to Ukraine. Defence Minister Richard Miles on the program earlier, though, says the aircraft will not be a target. We're confident about uh, the, the, the fact that it won't be targeted because it will not be going into those uh, air spaces, but it will be able to provide a, a really uh, important enabling function um, in this conflict. The Prime Minister has announced a $1 billion deal already that will see 100 Queensland-built Rhine metal boxer-heavy weapons carriers that will be sent to Germany from 2025, creating 1,000 jobs. Mr Albanese will travel to Lithuania shortly, actually, where he'll attend the NATO summit. So he's done with Germany now.